Welcome to the final video of this six-part series. If you've watched the previous videos, you have an understanding of why aligning the subtle structures is the best way to help your clients and patients get out of pain. I've received a lot of questions about the course, Foundations of Subtle Alignment, and I wanted to make a little video in order to answer those questions for you. I want to thank you for watching the videos, and I hope you've learned a lot from them. I've shown you how to access the subtle anatomy with your hands, and I've given you a lot of concepts as to why this work is so effective. I truly believe that this work is foundational, not only for just removing pain from the body, but also to open up more subtle structures, helping the organs to have a proper position to function optimally, helping the joint mobility so we have a better range of motion, it also moves into more subtle things with the energy of the body and it also releases the emotional blocks that we carry in our tissues. I want to let you know that registration for the course is going to start in a few more days. It's going to be a field guide for you to get this into your hands so that you can apply it to your clients and actually find the source of the problem. This is what's going to give you the ability to offer to your clients and patients lasting and profound results. When you sign up for the course, you will have access to me. We can work together on any questions that you might have while you're practicing. I understand that online courses for things that are tactile and things that I'm teaching you here are a little bit difficult, which is why I'm going to make sure that if you have any questions, I'm there for you. I want you to be confident in this modality and be able to comfortably integrate it into your own practice. One of the questions is, is if a beginner could take this course or if you have to be more advanced in the work. It's for everybody, anybody at all that wants to take the course. If you're a beginner, you'll be learning the fundamentals and if you're advanced, you'll be learning the fundamentals. In fact, in some strange way, it, it's gonna be easier for the beginners because some of the people who are more advanced are going to have to unlearn a little bit of what they've already learned to be able to apply the fundamentals of this technique. People have been asking me what kind of problems can be helped with this work. The answer to that is really any anybody with a structural problem can be helped. It's just a really good system to take care of physical pain as well as stress stresses that cause oftentimes cause physical pain. Injury, it'll help injuries. It's just a wide open field for things that it can help. A lot of times people are going through very difficult times and they can relax deeply so that they're going to be able to work through some of the emotional issues they may be working on. As you get into the practice, you're gonna notice that you see so many different things and that you'll be amazed at how many things really turn out well. Another question is if this can be worked into another modality, if it will complement another modality. And the answer to that is yes. In fact, it'll work with almost every modality. It will work with chiropractic work. It will work with acupuncture. It will work with physical therapy. It will work with massage therapy. And in fact, once you get the subtle anatomy understood and in your hands, it will actually enhance all of those modalities. So it can be integrated. And again, you have people coming in with various things that are happening in their body. So the skills that you may already know can be applied, but the important thing is, is to get the body aligned first, and then you can apply whatever else and you'll find that it will work better. Your, your modality that you're working is actually going to give you more optimal results and it will happen faster. Another concern is from people who have been doing deep tissue work in the massage therapy realm. It is a little bit tricky to get your clients to understand that they're not going to feel a whole lot. But in reality, as you apply these subtle techniques, you're actually going to go deeper into the body. You're just going to be doing it without force force you get the pushback of the body and you fight each other without force the body's going to invite you in and you'll go deeper and then you can apply more pressure once you're in there and you'll learn how to apply just the right amount of pressure so that you're not going to create that little pushback with the body 
which is trying to protect itself from harm. So it yes, it will work very well with deep tissue work. The trick to all of that is is that training your clients that they're not going to feel as much, but they're going to get the results are actually better. The clients that I've had that are used to more pressure, they will tell me that I can use more pressure if I want to. The best thing to do in that situation is to just ask them to just relax. You'll get there, but you're going to take your time getting there. Because when they're worried about that, they're actually in their head and they're thinking and they're still in a little more of a stressed state. When they can just trust that you're going to do it and you're going to get down where you, they need to and stop worrying about whether you're going deep enough or not, they're going to go into a more relaxed state. Then what happens is they find out when the session is all over that they feel really good but they have a little question mark over their head because they didn't feel it, but yet they feel better, but they didn't feel the work. So it makes it feel like it's a little bit magical, but it really isn't. So that would be the best thing I can tell you if your client is wanting you to go deeper. I also want to emphasize that if you do choose to continue to do like deep tissue work, that's okay. But knowing the subtle anatomy and knowing how to work the subtle anatomy is going to give you a way to modify what each person needs because everybody needs things a little bit different. So that way you'll have another platter of skills. You can either do deep tissue or you can do light tissue or you can combine and blend the two. And that way you're going to have a better skill set all in all. Another concern people have had is whether or not this is going to be too complex or too technical to learn. The answer to that is no, not really. You do need to have an understanding of the anatomy. You can get that by looking at pictures and studying pictures of the anatomy. But the essence of this whole work is learning how to get it in your hands and feeling what is wrong in the body and be able to correct it from that point. There's also a component to this work where you're going to be developing your own in intuitive senses. In other words, as you work more with the body, you're going to find that you're going to get messages from the body. It's like a communication. And as that develops, that's what's going to be much more important than any kind of technical type of thing that to learn. So I'll be teaching you how to tune into that intuitive part of you and how to apply that to the body and how to listen to the body so that the intuition can show you where to go. We have then the question of cost for the course. I just want to take the time right now to let you know that this is a very sensitive subject for me. I, I have been working at this for 35 years and I've probably put invested in myself about $50,000 in learning everything I've learned. Not to mention that I've probably worked 60 or 70,000 people over these years. They're still coming in brand new and several of them a week, even though my practice is a lot smaller now. When somebody feels good and you've done a good job at the work, they'll tell their friends. And before you know it, you're not going to have to do any advertising. You're not going to have to do any of that because the word of mouth is going to spread like wildfire, which is what it has done for me. I want you to remember that what you invest for yourself to improve will always come back to you and it'll usually come back tenfold. I hope I've answered some of your questions. The course is open to anyone, but I want you to be aware that the tutoring sessions that are private with me are going to have limited space. And so that will be on a first come first serve basis because once you get to working at this, you are going to have questions and it's better to have them answered earlier than later. In the next few days, I'm going to be launching the course. You'll be getting an email with instructions on how to sign up. I'm really excited about sharing this course with you and I'm happy to answer more questions that you have. That's all for now. I hope you enjoyed this video series and I look forward to seeing you in class.